We All right, we are rolling. Or can you see okay? I can. Yes. How about I go to the other side? You know, you can go wherever you feel like that. It'd be good. We got Jesse here. Jesse, how you doing, bud? You've been you haven't been in in a while, but apparently you had a little something done. Just a little. Okay, you're gonna make everybody seasick if you make the camera jump around. I wanna start out, can I start over? Yeah, we're, we're rolling, rolling here okay. with Jesse. We got Jesse and Jesse's mom. Mom is actually videoing us, videoing Jesse. <laughs> so <Good> time. <laughs> We'll all have plenty of evidence for the court case later, right? Yes, yeah, sir. I don't know, Your Honor. Better right. not have a court case. <laughs> I don't remember there being any videos, sir. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Games to protect the animals. Okay, so you've got a bunch of staples you've come in you've got, uh, for us to remove. When did you have these put in? Mm. Jesse's mother. <laughs> August 13th. Deferring over here. August 13th. All right, so we're about 10 days out, 10, yeah. 11 days. And you had to have a you had to have a little repositioning done, right? Mm -hmm. uh, you were you were born with uh, gastro gastro gastroschisis is a birth defect of the abdominal wall. The baby's intestines are found outside of the baby's body, exiting through a hole beside the belly button. The hole can be small or large, and sometimes other organs such as the stomach or liver can be found outside the baby's body. Gastroschisis and a malrotation and of the intestines. There we go. So, as a result, you were having some issues and you went and you saw the surgeon and they said, hey, you're due for a tune-up, pal. They took your appendix out, they relocated the colon, right? Mm -hmm. And the small intestines. And the small intestines, okay. So you guys are hearing it the same time I'm hearing it here. So we're doing this and letting everybody watch. So you don't mind if we video you for all our friends on, uh, I don't know, Vid Me, Vid Me and Steam and um, Not one bit. maybe even some YouTube down the road. Who knows? We don't use uh, you, we don't put anything on YouTube new. We only put reruns on YouTube now. We don't like their policies. Have you had any fevers or chills or anything? Mm, not lately. Any drainage from any of these? Nope. Is this hurting? Not too bad. It's very manageable. Okay, good. Just a little bit of a pinch, maybe? Yep. Ooh, this one's deep in there. Mm -hmm. That one there's, yeah, right there. That it one came there. out. We got it. We got it. It wasn't that bad, was it? Nope. You ever had staples removed before? No, sir. So you never had them put in then, huh? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> if you have, you still got them. I know that. So uh, you were going to do this yourself, and you can actually do this. You can remove these. It's just really difficult. And it hurts a lot to do it with a couple of pliers. Or tweezers. Oh, tweezers are almost impossible. You have to have something a little bit more power. Or this special little staple remover and tool here is really good, too. Mm -hmm. So when do you follow? Did you feel that one a little bit? Yeah. That one you got a little sting on that one? When do you follow back up with the surgeon? Um, well, we were going to... We don't. So all of this happened in Tyler. I live in Houston. Mm -hmm. So I won't follow back up with her. Mm-hmm. I'd like to keep the staples. He wants the staples? That's an you can have request, all of this. No, it's not yes. an odd request. I was kind of hoping you would keep the staples. One of my roommates was giving me a hard time, so I said, you know what? I'll keep them in a jar for you, and I'll Smart bring them back to yep. you. So this is all dry except for one little spot here at the very top has a little leak to it, just a little ooze. I don't think that's infected, um, but I want to keep an eye on that. No ointment on this. Don't put anything on this. Just keep a dry dressing on it. For a few more days, okay? That's all we're going to ask you to do. If this weeping continues, we'll need to know. Okay. All right. have to watch that because he's headed back to College Station today for college. I'm so sorry. I know. Senior year. Could use a few more weeks for you <laughs> dive in. I but, think you, know. you ought to try to get some kind of uh, medical excuse. Oh, uh, um, believe me. Yeah. I think that you got kind of ripped off on your summer. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> she have tried at the end. <laughs> All right, so we're going to put all these staples in a little Thank you. container Thank you. for you. And uh, if you have any more problems, you let us know. Thanks for letting us record well, uh, you. your procedure. My pleasure. All right, bye, guys. Are you dizzy? Yeah. <laughs> Are you taking your Meta 7? Yes. Right. I always have so much energy. <laughs> Meta okay, we're going. Tell us about Meta 7. Yes, yes. Meta 7 is great. Um, you suggested for me last time I was here, right? three months ago, and I take it every morning like I'm supposed to, and it works. I'm not jittery, and it gives me energy that lasts, and I'm even able to go to sleep at night as well. So, How about cramps? Good. Are you getting any muscle cramps? No muscle cramps. Awesome. No, no. Mm -hmm. So you love it? I love it. I really do. Fantastic. Thank you. Well, we're going to refill you today. Great. All right.